If you wish to learn more about the bow, or obtain sun-hallowed arrows for it, I'd be more than happy to help. You've but to ask. I was expecting. Still, it's beautiful. Well, before we spoke to my mother in the Soul Cairn, I would have said we'd bring the bow to my father. But after everything with her, I don't think we can trust him. I keep thinking that there's got to be another way, but he'll turn on us both the moment he gets the chance. No, he has to die. We have no choice. Thank you. Somehow I knew you'd understand. I welcome you, friend. Oh, you've returned. Is your... Keeping you entertained. You know why we're here. Of course I do. You disappoint me, Serana. You've taken everything I provided for you and thrown it all away for this pathetic half-breed vampire. Provided for me? Are you insane? You've destroyed our family. You've killed other vampires all over some prophecy that we barely understand. No more. I'm done with you. You will not touch him. So, I see this dragon has fangs. Your voice drips with the venom of your mother's influence. How alike you've become. No. Because unlike her, I'm not afraid of you. Not anymore. And you. It appears I have you to thank for turning my daughter against me. I knew it was only a matter of time before your ambition outgrew your loyalty. A small price to pay for the betterment of our kind. Oh, come now. Spare me your notions of kinship. You've simply used Serana in an attempt to take away what should rightfully be mine. The vampire is eternal, and with immortality comes the revelation that these bonds never endure. It's fleeting, momentary at best. Yes, quite. I'm growing weary of speaking to you and my traitorous daughter. I'll give you a single chance to turn over the bow to me. There will not be a second. Very well then, you leave me no choice.
it's done. I'm not sure. I'll probably stay here for as long as they'll let me. I think we can rebuild here. Make my family's legacy something more respectable. Of course, if you've got any more adventures planned... That's what I wanted to hear. I'm Lord right Hark defeated. I never imagined I'd see the day. My lady, you have my deepest sympathies. I am sure this was not easy for you. He was out of control, though. It had to be done. I'm not happy about this. He was still my father. But I suppose my father really died a long time ago. This was just the end of something else. Of course, my dear. All will be well now. My congratulations on defeating Harkon. Clearly, you are the superior vampire. You are the new master. We bow to your power. Power which, I note, includes Oriol's bow. The castle, of course, is yours. We shall follow you and help spread your influence across Skyrim. I am above the petty squabbles here. I have lived for far too long to be bothered. I saw more than enough political overing in my time in house dress. I have never understood the Nord fascination with weapons. Magic is so much more versatile. 